In our previous examples, we had seen when we were cutting vegetables with a knife, the knife exerts pressure. Or when you were hammering a nail into a wooden plank, the hammer exerts pressure. Which means the solids exerts pressure. Do liquids exert pressure? Yeah, like solids, liquids also exert pressure. Okay, now let's see how liquid is exerting pressure by doing a small activity. Take a bottle of water, pour some hole into it. You can see the water is coming out. But why the water is coming out? Because the liquid, that is the water in the bottle, exerts pressure in all directions of the bottle. That is why when you pour some hole into the bottle, the water was coming out. So we can say like this, the water exerts pressure on the walls of the bottle. So students, here you have learned liquids exerts pressure.